Hi, everybody. This is a pre-accident podcast, and I am Todd Conklin, your lovely host, and this is a safety moment comment. Here we go. A little different today, isn't it? So I've gotten a bunch of comments about why on earth in this podcast of all podcasts would you end the podcast by asking people to be safe? And does asking people to be safe mean the same thing now that it would have meant had I said it 20 years ago or when you say it? to your kids or family or dog or friends or workers? That's a really good question, actually. I think it's a great question. Because asking workers to be safe does absolutely nothing to create safety in the workplace. In fact, it is probably as stupid of a thing to do as you could possibly do. But you know what? It feels okay. And it feels like something you want to say. And I really do want people to be safe. But I say be safe as if safety was in their control. That's a really hard question. And it's one to think about. I'll tell you this much. I don't think asking you to be safe makes the world a safer place. But I do think asking you to be safe reminds me that I have a role in your safety success. Now, that's interesting. Because this is one I want you to think about. I don't think you can use this as an OE moment, as a safety moment. But I do think you can use it to think about exactly the question I was forced to think about. Which is, how can you espouse all this information and then fall right back to this old be safer and you'll be safer comment? Hmm, it's good. And it's worth thinking over. I will tell you that this is one that I'm going to have to spend some time on. Because I'm slipping back to a world where I think the worker has ultimate control. And if the worker would make good choices, safety would be a part of that. And I know that plays. I know that's a big part of the game. And I know that I am in charge, accountable and responsible for the outcomes that I create. But I'm not sure I'm completely in control of the systems in which I create those outcomes. So maybe a better way to end this podcast, instead of saying be safe, would be to say find places where safety is not available in your operation, identify them, and help be a part of fixing those problems. I'm not sure that's as romantic of an ending, but I think it's one for us to think about. Thanks for listening, and thanks for thinking about this. Always, always, always get a chance, subscribe, and have your friends and coworkers listen as well. That helps a ton. Learn something every single day. Have fun. And for goodness sakes, try to identify organizational weaknesses in your system, highlight them, and then be a part of those solutions so you can work in an environment where safety is an outcome of the process systems you have. Talk to you later. (laughs) 